Welcome to Photography Basics in two minutes. And these are the three main principles you're gonna need. ISO or ISO. This would have been film light sensitivity in a manual film camera, but now on a modern day camera is purely just a numerical setting that defines how much light noise you're gonna get on a shot. The basic rule is, if you're looking for a bright sunshine shot, use 100, and if you're looking to shoot something like the night or starlight, go for something like a 1600 if you want to see everything. Aperture or f-stop. Essentially how much light is going to come into the lens, the amount of light that's going to hit the sensor. All you really need to know is that the smaller the number, the faster or shallower the exposure, the higher the number, the slower the wider the exposure. So if you want a nice blurry background, go for a low number, and if you want a really detailed landscape, go for a high number. Make sure you just play in between. Shutter speed. It is what it says on the tin. It's the amount of time the shutter is open on your camera. You can get a lot of different effects by changing the shutter speed. You can freeze things in motion, you can get some movement shown there, or you can get a really nice clean looking line using a slow shutter speed. Shutter speeds are defined as hundredths of a second, so the lowest you'll generally find is one one thousandth of a second, all the way through to about a 30 second exposure. The trick is, if you want to capture something exactly as it is then, use the highest speed you can, like a one one thousandth, and if you want to show a nice gradual movement, move up to something like a half a second, and you'll start to see all that movement in that shot. And that's it, that is photography basics in two minutes or less. So stick your camera on manual and play away and subscribe for more.